for the very first time on stage, please make welcome Maria Rowdy! hours since um, I quit being a liar I mean a lawyer a lawyer and um, I would love to tell you a true story um, about how I decided to finally quit the profession uh, so this engineer dies and some mistake he gets sent to hell a few months later angels learn about it tell God God picks up the phone calls devil and says devil you get an engineer there, clearly a mistake. Engineers never, ever, ever go to hell. So you gotta return him. And Devil says, no, you know what? We really love having him here. He installed flushing toilets, <laughs> escalators. We got air conditioning now. He's finishing working on botanical gardens. And we're actually thinking of building our first skyscraper. <laughs> God says, return him immediately, I'll sue you. And the devil says, well, <laughs> where do you think all the lawyers are? Yeah. <laughs> so a thing about me is that I'm actually from Ukraine, and it's like minus 30 there for like half a year. So I realized retiring in hell is not really the best place for me. <laughs> So yeah, I decided to quit being a lawyer and I started banging as many engineers as I can handle. <laughs> I mean, well, by the time I retire, I really need to get as much goodness inside of me, somehow. Yeah, um, the only thing I still can't figure out where my soul is, like, do you think it's closer to those lips or to those? Um, are there any engineers here tonight? I'll enjoy searching for my soul this weekend. Mm, find me later. Um, so as I mentioned, I'm from Ukraine. And I would like to address the stereotypes straight away. We don't start drinking vodka the day we're born. We start eating bacon. We love bacon. We eat it for breakfast, for lunch, at night. We eat more bacon than Kermit the Frog, since he met Miss Piggy. Well, you know, in heaven they probably don't allow it, and in hell it's always crispy. So when to enjoy it, if not now. And uh, my tummy knows that. Oh, my tummy knows that it's Ukrainian. But the rest of my body has some sort of split personality issues. Or it thinks that it's Nations United or something. Because let's take my liver, for example. I it definitely doesn't know it's inside of East European. Because I get tipsy just by looking at a bottle of alcohol. And if I want to get drunk, all I have to do is just sniff the, the cork from the wine bottle. So, yeah, it, well, it saved me a lot of money, to be honest, over the years. But makes it very tricky to socialize here in Australia. Especially on weeknights. <laughs> so it probably thinks it's somewhere from Middle East or something. And uh, my hair, it probably thinks it's Asian. Because remember that um, the Vietnam War? No matter what Americans threw at Vietnamese, they just couldn't bloody win. So that's my relationship with my hair my entire life. No matter how much I straighten it, no matter how much I, whatever, I throw at it, it just curls back up and flips me the bird. Yeah, and um, yeah, my boobs and my butt, they think I'm black. They went all the way Nicki Minaj and Queen Latifah. And unfortunately, they don't come with at least some of the money that these two have. But you know what they come with? Back pain. 
<laughs> I feel like I'm working on the construction site of the Egyptian pyramid. But you know, I can't really get mad at them because they're lending me every engineer I want. <laughs> Pay my ticket to heaven, so I'll see you there. <laughs>